Lee, it'll be great to get back to league action tomorrow afternoon as we travel to face Hamilton. How has training been this week with the players? Training's been good, good tempo to training, it's been bubbly. Um, weekend off last week, so the training, training's been quite intense um, all week, so all geared up to the game Saturday and, and really looking forward to it. As you touched on there, what are your thoughts going into tomorrow's match? Just to go and try and win the game, just like every other game, try and cause Hamilton uh, problems. Um, we've studied them this week, um, we've had a couple of match reports on them for the, la for the last couple of weeks. They're a team that's probably playing the best football they've played this season, so we're under no illusions how hard it's going to be. Um, but we'll go there, try to cause them problems and, and win the match. The league is currently very tight at the bottom of the table. Will the players take that into consideration going into tomorrow's match? Well, just like every other game, you need to go and win it or, or pick up points. I think with five games left, um, anything's still possible. So this is... We, we don't ever look too far ahead of us. We, we need to go there with a game plan to go and pick up points. Um, and hopefully in doing that is winning the game. We anticipate a large travelling support to Hamilton tomorrow. What is your message to them and to all the supporters going into the remaining five fixtures? Brilliant. First of all, brilliant that there's, that there's a good support going tomorrow. The, the Hamilton Stadium is a, a place where any time I've been with Kilmarnock, they've, it's, it's been near a sellout and uh, the fans have acted as a, as a 12th man. Um, and that's why maybe we've got a half-decent record there. Um, but tomorrow, we need the fans. We need the fans behind us. The, the, the team needs the fans behind us and uh, hopefully we'll put on a performance uh, that, that doesn't disappoint them.